Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to the Bowtie Breakdown. I'm Gary Morin, and before we get into today's video, I want to say thank you to all of you for your love and support of this channel. This channel is meant to be fun and informative, and hopefully along the way you find the content helpful. Don't forget, if you haven't done so already, make sure you like and subscribe. And if you have any questions or videos you'd like to see, make sure you leave some comments below. Now let's get right into it. Today, I'm going to discuss the difference between mobile homes and modular homes. Very similar properties, but actually quite different. Let's take a look at mobile homes first. They usually can be found set in mobile home parks with a homeowner association and come in single and double wide layouts, which is pretty cool. Now what makes them a mobile home, you ask? Well, in most cases, mobile homes are actually have a trailer hookup and wheels hidden underneath the skirt. They're built with the idea that the homeowner can place them pretty much wherever they want. In most cases, the mobile homes aren't meant to be moved every single day. I mean, they're not campers, but they certainly could be if you needed to. Usually there's no basement and the home sits on a concrete slab. Each unit will have its own utilities such as water, electricity, heat, sewer and septic, etc. And in some cases, the water and sewer may be included in the HOA fees with the rules and regulations. Best to check that out. The unit usually sits on leased land, meaning the owner only owns the mobile home structure, not the land. That's regulated by the HOA. I'll get into detail on that in another video. On the interior, just like regular homes, you can expect to find updated kitchens and baths, granite countertops, and even vaulted ceilings. In some cases, you can find parks that only allow residents 55 years and older. Each park rules vary, so best to review all rules and regulations before buying or entering into a contract. Now, let's discuss modular homes. Why are they different from mobile homes? Well, most commonly they don't have wheels or trailer hookups and are meant to be set on a more permanent site. Similar to mobile homes, modular homes often sit on leased land. Modular homes are actually manufactured off-site, partially assembled, and then transported to the property site to be fully assembled right then and there. You may have even seen them on the highway. Giant trucks draped with wide load flags carrying sections of pre-built homes. Just like mobile homes, there's usually no basement as they sit on concrete slabs. Modular homes can be also found in park-like settings similar to mobile home parks. They will also have rules and regulations along with HOA fees. And each unit will have its own utilities including water, sewer, septic, electrical, etc. Mobile homes and modular homes are very similar, but now you know the difference. That was another bow tie breakdown. I'm Gary Morin. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.